You must be elated with that. What, what do you make of it? How do you summarise it? Uh, yeah, really pleased. I thought uh, we were a little bit sloppy at the start of the game, uh, but we, we grew into it as the game went on the second half. We just, just asked them at half time just to be really clinical and just, just, just be composed in that second half, and we were. You know, I couldn't really ask for any more for that second half performance. Well, you spoke before the game about wanting to make a statement today, and uh, you certainly did that. Yeah, we did. I was just a bit disappointed with our train this week. I just thought we were a little bit flat, and I think it's that time of the season where you can take your eye off the ball a little bit, and I thought we'd done that this week, but fortunately for us today, we, we, we switched on after that first five or ten minutes, and we put in a really clinical performance. And I know Tom Gilmore obviously got player of the match, sensational today, but let's talk about Johnny Campbell as well. I mean, going over for four tries, that's something special. Yeah, he just keeps getting better. He's like Benjamin Button. He just keeps, he's 35 years old, but he's, he's, he's you know, he's, his effort levels and his enthusiasm, it's fantastic, you know, so long may it continue, he's signed again for next year, so he's, uh, he's chasing my tri-scoring record at the club, so I might have to drop him soon. Well, I'm so happy for you today. Hendo, go on, you, you pitch in. Craig, how are you? Great, great, great result, mate. How, how pleased are you there after that? You know, obviously it was a disappointing loss to witness last week at home. Uh, how pleased were you to turn that around? Because I thought it was a slow start to the game. When you look at that opening yeah. 10 minutes from you guys, I didn't think. I thought he was a little bit in second gear. He didn't sort of come out the blocks. I yeah. thought Dewsbury really started with some enthusiasm and some energy. Um, but I thought once you got that first try, you found your groove and um, you know, got, the, got the job done in there. But how pleased were you with that? Yeah, really pleased. I think it nail and dead there. We said at the start of the game, we just, we just started really flat and we, and we knew it would be in a, a derby game. Dewsbury fighting for lives down at the bottom. They'd come out yeah. really enthused and energetic and... You know, try and, and try and give us nothing. And we turned over cheap possession in his own 20 meter area too many times. But luckily for us, we managed to get his heads on it. And we just talk about ending the sets well and just just building building with defence and earning the right to be in the, the areas of the field to score tries. And and that's what we did. And really clinical in that second half. And how key and pivotal is Tom Gilmore to this team and to your to your push for the playoffs? Yeah, he's, he's real good. He's real pivotal. He's, that, that's that's the that's what the money men are paid for, aren't they? You know, they, they get you around the field. But people like Ben White and James Meadows and Luke Cooley as well, they, they, they all form part of that spine. And um, it, it, Alistair Leake and Ben Kay as well, they, they've been real good, real good for us. And they, they all work together. Craig, I thought Tom Gilmore did a real good job in changing the mentality of the team. Obviously, because you had a bit of a slow start the first 10 minutes, but his kicking game changed the mentality of the team just the way he was really strategic in his, in his, in his box kicks, yep. making sure Callum Turner came out of the, the real tough end. How critical will his game management be in the big games come the end of the season? Oh, massive, you know, we, 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 we tried to take a leaf out of witnesses, but last week against us at our place, and that's all they did. They, you know, they, they didn't try and find an end, the end that wasn't there. They just put the ball in the right areas of the field and made us work out, of, out, out defensively, and we couldn't get out there. You know, the, uh, similar to, to uh, us today, the end of the sets in the right area, force repeat sets, and it's difficult to defend repeat set after repeat set, and eventually you're going to score. You know, so hopefully that's a, a bit of a blueprint for us now for, for the remainder of the season, that we don't have to find ends, ends that are out there. Just build pressure and you'll earn that reward. Well, congratulations today, Craig. We're all so happy for you. Well done for a big result.